In the previous video, we have looked at the theory behind the Doppler shift and all the necessary knowledge you need to know related to it. So now we're going to look at some examples. Here's the first one. A particular spectral line in the spectrum of a star is found to have 600.80 nanometers. So this is wavelength you observe uh, from a star compared to 600 as measured in the lab. So this will be our reference wavelength in lab. What is the velocity of the star? Is it moving towards or away from us? So before we plug in everything, I want us to think about the change in wavelength. The original wavelength is 600. Then you see eh, it become a bit longer. So we can already conclude that wavelength becomes longer. So it's redshifted. So redshift means moving away from us or also known as it is receding receding means to move away this is the what the word means okay so we need to calculate the velocity i think i'll just stick with red color because why not it's red shift right or orange color so the equation here you want to use is ratio of change in wavelength over the wavelength equals to speed over speed of light so change in wavelength Okay, so the, I guess the, a, a general one you can stick with is whatever you observe minus whatever your reference wavelength is. In this case, it will be the lab. So our observed wavelength is 600.80 minus your reference in the lab over the reference wavelength, which is 600.00. This will be equal to the velocity of this star that is moving away from us, yeah, away from us, over the speed of light, which is 3 times 10 to the power of 8. This constant, you can find the first page of every question booklet or your calculator or just memorize it. Lah. <laughs> so the velocity of the star here is going to be 4.0 times 10 to the 5 meters per second. Just for fun, if you don't know how fast this is, this is roughly 400 kilometers per second. One second, 400 kilometers, it fly already. That is like, I'm going Google map now, okay? Go, 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 map, go, Google. So we're going to leave this in meters per second. So one thing to point out is, note that when you minus uh, observe wavelength minus uh, reference wavelength, you get a positive value. Okay, so in this, pos in this in if you stick to this convention, positive value means moving away. Receding. Receding. Okay, so that's all for this quick short one. We'll look at a few more. See you in the next one.